when you want to put the dimensions on your drawing you use command D or you just pick that button and you click here there and you don't see any dimensions yet then you have to select it and you go to properties and you see you have here different buttons you check that you click on properties for dimensions and then you can choose a style you go for millimeter architectural and you see it already appearing and because we work in a scale on 50 or 20 you choose the scale you want to have and now you have your dimensions let's check if you keep the setting if you put in another one uh, not yet so I'll just select it again choose your default uh, millimeter and then uh, 50 like that if it's still a kind of problem and you cannot get your dimensions in Rhino you can switch to Illustrator and to do it like uh, on this uh, simple way you pick the slides when you hold shift it goes straight and you can move that line in the place where it's uh, supposed to be and you draw another line and another line push shift and then it's appeared uh, it's also good to hit, to give some different thickness than your drawing. It's, it's, it's supposed to be your PDF drawing, so I'm just uh, showing it for you as an example. So you can select these lines and choose a different thickness. So it will need some difference with your drawing. And then you put here you see this stroke if you don't have it just check in the window I'll show you in the window and then you go to stroke so when you select it you can choose what kind of arrow heads you want to have yeah, let's say this there you go. and they are one same or you can just go for this one the other one make it as well straight and in that case you can even maybe delete this one and to put here some text you put it here two three zero zero and to rotate it I push this and then you got this uh, blue dot here you push enter and we say 90 degrees to you okay so now you've got your measurements here as well and just as a just as a interesting information you've got here much more like you can put the aligned uh, dimensions or put the angles or uh, radius so just try it out and I hope it will help good luck